Hi members, Alan here from The Pro Shop. We're with Jono, Superintendent of the Golf Course. Jono, lots going on this time of year. Plenty. We've had the clubbies just finish. Yeah, all very successful, all wrapped up, except for the weather. We had a bit of a yep. 44 mil fell in one day. That was a bit unfortunate, which uh, ruined a lot of the bunkers and we had to place them under um, uh, some sort of restriction, which was unfortunate. Yep. Um, it's just one of those things. Can't call those, but yeah, it happens sometimes. The rest of the course is fantastic. Um, talk us through the greens. Obviously we're not coring. We're tr doing a trial at the moment. Correct, we did the uh, what's called a ninja time, which is a tiny, tiny four millimeter time that we're taking out the greens. We're gonna do that once a month instead of a, a big core twice a year, which will take yep. out about 15 mil cores, which is quite large, about like your finger. Yep. Um, we're gonna try this once a month and see if we get the same result. Um, yeah, we're just sort of gonna wait and see what happens. So yeah. we're, we're pretty impressed. We did it last week and um, yeah. it was fantastic. It came up really well. Yeah, the greens are rolling still absolutely perfectly. You can still see the little holes, but it's not really affecting the golf ball. It's fantastic. No, no, that's to allow nutrients of water and oxygen and things like that to get into the green. So, yep. you know, we're, we're best of both worlds, really. Yeah, excellent. And obviously the board have approved um, the, the works that we're doing on the ninth and the practice bunker. What's the sort of timeline on that sort of stuff happening? Look, we're allowing two to three weeks. We're hoping it's going to be a little bit shorter. There's always a variable weather and things like that, turf and things like that. Things can always change minorly, not yeah. too major. Yeah. So yeah, they've, they've busted out the uh, the chipping green already, which has come out fantastic, the chipping yeah. green bunker, sorry. And um, they've just started the ninth today, uh, which is what, the 30th, I think, today. Yeah. Um, so we're allowing a, a fair bit of time for that one because there's a lot of work. So we're yeah. hoping Round two, two and a half weeks, three weeks, something Good. like that. Excellent. I've had a look at the chip and it looks like we can fit about six or seven people across to hit bunker shots all at once. So it's not sort of one person at a time, which is great for everyone that wants to do some practice at the bunkers. And I know most of you all need the practice, so that's great. <laughs> um, what about other course works? We're standing on the second tee. Looks like you've redone, repatched the back of the second because it was a little bit uneven and there was... Uh, yeah, tree roots and stuff in we there. We had some severe uh, tree root issues on the back of the second and the 14th tee. They've been creeping in over the years and years and years. They're, they're from the she oak tree, which is very invasive. Uh, but really sucked these two tees uh, dry. We were, turf to climb was severe, so we thought we'd get up here with our excavator and drag all the roots out down to about a foot, which we found pure sand on both tees. They've both been relayed. They're gonna take a little bit of time to knit in. Um, but yeah, they're as good as gold now. They're like a billiard table at the minute, so they should be great uh, for future board events and um, any events on the on the back tees. Excellent. Any other turfing areas at the moment? Because it is growing season. That's why you do it this time that's, of year. That's exactly right. Yeah. We've, we've got a, an area in front of the fifth new bunkers that we did that went a bit sour over winter, got a bit saturated and rotted a little bit. So we're going to uh, re-turf that. Uh, the pinch point, um, what I call the pinch point on the 11th to the 12th, where everybody goes. It just compacts and, and things like that. So that's always going to get worn out. Again, we'll probably do that in a couple of years' time. That's just going to be a, a thing we're just going to have to continue on. There are a couple of other turfing areas, like if it's a bit near on from the 16th green to the 17th tees and things like that. There, you'll see uh, various amounts of works going on, just mainly turf, laying turf and yep. things like that. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you to all your staff as well, John. You do an amazing job. Thanks, um, the course has always has been in fantastic condition for a long, long time on a consistent Thanks, basis, which is great. So thank you. Members, any questions, send us an email, drop us a line. Um, any, any thoughts on what the course is doing and how good the course is, please. We only generally hear about the bad. Let's hear about some good because we've got a pretty good facility here. We're pretty lucky. So uh, until next time, we'll see you then.